Hello, my name is Paul Naska. Um, I'm a senior at Westminster College in the economics and philosophy departments. And I had the privilege to take a few classes from KL in the Honors College. And they're focused on global politics and, and war. And um, in, in those classes, KL was always the one to bring in interests and voices that didn't usually get heard. You know, if we're having if we were having a discussion about the Iraq War, it would us it would hit the usual notes. Uh, there was a position about you know who benefits, what are the economic interests in the war, and then maybe a conversation about well, was there a legitimate national defense interest? And Gail was the one who would say yeah, those things are important, but what is also important is the the cost to the people on the ground. What do policy decisions in war mean for an American soldier or their family or for Iraqis? Um, and then he would usually launch into a first-hand account of the real human cost of that war. And if you ever get a chance to uh, read his book, even outside the context of your decision, of who to vote for. I think that it's a unique perspective on that war because Kale was an American on the ground for years mediating between the American military and the, the, the civil society in Iraq and Afghanistan. Um, but I think what we have the opportunity to, to do now in voting for Kale is putting somebody in our legislature who has the experience to offer uh, accounts of the effects of, the, of policy decisions. Um, if, if I, I want the people that are making decisions about when and where we go to war and uh, if and how people are going to receive medical care to have the experience to say this is what it looks like when, when we go to war and this is what it looks like when we deny people access to health care um, because I think the, the stories that we tell are, 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 are really powerful things and if those stories aren't getting told in our legislature then um, ultimately we, we, we won't move in the right direction um, so Weston for Congress